A speed reducer has 20 degrees full depth teeth and consists of a 20 tooth steel spur pinion driving a 50 tooth cast iron gear. The horsepower transmitted is 12 at a pinion speed of 1200 revolutions per minute. For a diametral pitch of 8 teeth per inch and a phase width of 1.5 inches, what would the contact stress be? This is the first example for the surface fatigue failure main video. Link below. The contact stress sigma c will depend on the elastic coefficient cp, which in turn depends on the elastic modulus and Poisson's ratio of the material of the gear and the pinion. For some common material combinations, we can skip using this equation and use some pre-calculated values from the table. Just like we did for the examples of the previous main video, link below, the velocity factor kv for cut or milled profiles in English units will depend on the pitch line velocity and therefore the diameter of the pinion. With the pinion's diameter and its pitch line velocity in feet per minute, we find the velocity factor. Just like we also did in the previous examples, we find the tangential component of the interaction force by using the power and rotation speed information, of course using the appropriate units. The radius variables are those of the radius of curvature for the teeth of the pinion and the gear, not the pitch radius of the gears. Finding the pitch diameter of the gear, and therefore the two radii of curvature, we find everything we need to calculate the contact stress. For one more example on contact stresses and pitting, make sure to check out the link in the description below. Thanks for watching.